Hello, hello, everyone. Hello, hello. Hello, Santos. Santos, are you there, Santos? Hello. Okay, welcome, welcome everyone. Santos, can you hear me, Santos? Good evening, hello. Okay, good evening, welcome. I thought it was just me and Santos, and Santos was not hello, responding. Hello. Hola, hola. Hola, hola, probando, probando sonido. Probando sonido, I sí. see. <laughs> okay, welcome, Wendy. Welcome, Hi. Jose. Mm -hmm. How is the weather like over there? How is the weather like? I not understand. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. Voy a, voy a typear como dicen. How, Please. how is the weather like over there? Okay. How is the weather like over there? ¿Qué tal está el clima por allá? ¿Qué tal está el clima um, por allá? How is the weather like over there? Mm -hmm. So how is the weather over like over there? Mm -hmm. Hot. 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 Wow. Hot too. Mm -hmm. You know, here in Morazán, it's been raining since... Mm -hmm. Vamos a ver, ¿desde qué hora estaba lloviendo? Ah, qué nice. Desde como a las cuatro ha estado lloviendo. Mm -hmm. Está fresco. And right now, well, apparently it stopped raining. Yes, it stopped raining. Mm -hmm. Aquí medio cayó algo, pero ha quedado un vapor. So the humid, right? It's very humid. humid. La humedad, yeah, it's very humid. Sí. All right, so welcome. Welcome, Marvin. Welcome, um, Noemi. It's good to see you today. How was your job today? How was it? Um... It's stressful. Oh, it's stressful? But remember, yeah. it's just one day to go on vacation. Well, tomorrow, the last day. <laughs> <laughs> Good for you, because Saturday is my last day of work. Saturday. So it means that I, until Saturday, I'm going to be like, yes. Hallelujah. Like you say that. Hallelujah. <laughs> yes. Um. So welcome, Elmer. Welcome, Marvin. And welcome as well, everyone. All right, so I'm very happy to see you one more time in today's class. And let me share, voy a buscar la carpeta, to share with you today's class, okay? Class number seven. Wow, we are almost in the middle of what? In the middle of the course, right? Today is yeah. our seventh uh, class. Wow, that is unbelievable. Because I feel like we just started yesterday. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, because we are working on Friday, that's why we are advancing, right? All right. Today, we will talk about wishes. wishes. Yes, we're going to be talking about wishes. So um, we're going to be talking about some of the wishes we have. And then we are going to be expressing those um, expressions that we say, I wish, oh, como desearía tener esto, como deseo esto, oh, yo desearía ir allá, oh, yo de those kind of expressions, we are going to learn today how to express those wishes, not in Spanish, but in English, all right, uh, we're going to be talking about dreams, we're going to be talking about wishes and practice, all right, by the end of the class, a student will learn how to express wishes, that they have about their personal life, career, or health, okay? All right, yesterday we talked about, remember, comparison between two places. Do you remember? Yesterday we were comparing a house and an apartment. Ahora tengo acá um, dos parques, Central Park and Parque Cusquetlán. Look one sentence that I have over there. Central Park is as green as 
Parque Cuscatlán. All right, vamos a ver. Can you tell me a sentence using that, as, as, ¿se acuerdan? Tan verde como, tan, tan. ¿Se acuerdan que aprendimos eso ayer? Uh -huh. Yes. Ok. Uh -huh. As, as. Pueden comparar Central Park con el Parque Cujutlán. But just looking at the picture, right? Because probably you can tell me, mire teacher, I've never been to uh, Central Park. Or mire teacher, I've never been to Parque Cuscatlán. But by just looking at the pictures, we can come with some sentences. Podemos pensar algunas preguntas. I mean, sentences. Um, mm -hmm. Many people um, walking around at the okay. uh, Central Park as. Mm -hmm. What about uh, what about if I give you the adjective beautiful? Vamos a ver. Si yo le doy el adjetivo beautiful, can you tell me a sentence? Comparing Central both. Central Park is as beautiful as Park Cuscatlán. Excelente. Yes. Good. Good, Wendy. Very good. Ah, All right. No, no, no. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah. Yeah. But what about, what about if I say that one park it's more beautiful than the other one. ¿Cómo sería? Uh -huh. Si yo dijera que uno de los parques es más, es más bonito que el otro. Oh. O sea, ¿cuál para ustedes, cuál es más bonito? Vamos a ver. You have to say the park is ah, okay. more beautiful. Uh, it's, uh, it's as beautiful um, than Central Park. Ok, you can say Parque Cuscatlán isn't isn't as beautiful as Parque Cuscatlán, ok? Lo que estoy diciendo, I mean, Central Park. Lo que estoy diciendo es que el Parque Cuscatlán no es tan bonito como el Central Park, ok? All right. So, ayer estábamos aprendiendo esta expresión. <clears throat> Let me underline it. Ok, ¿se acuerdan? Yes, uh, sí. Y el adjetivo, ¿verdad? Yeah. En medio. ¿Se acuerdan? Yes. Yes, sí, sure. Ok, vamos a ver. ¿Me pueden, pueden pensar acerca de una, una sentence? Que estén comparando los dos parques. Vamos a ver. Les voy a dar un adjetivo. ¿Qué adjetivo puedo utilizar? O, oh, ¿qué les parece si les doy el adjetivo big? Big. S B S. I'm sorry. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh -huh. Si le diera el adjetivo big, ¿qué oración? Acuérdense que aquí puede ser uh, negativo. Central Park uh -huh. is, uh, is, is as big as Parque Cuscatlán. Ok. Uh -huh. Ok. Aunque, aunque, to be honest, el Central Park es muchísimo, muchísimo más grande <laughs> que el Parque Cuscatlán. Sí, yes. sí. Yes. Creería yo que solo el parque de Guatlán es solamente el lago que ustedes ven allí en el, en el Central Park. Uh -huh. Probably. Ya. Yeah. El parque de Guatlán. Ajá. Uh -huh. Isen uh -huh. as B as uh -huh. for park. Good, yes. good job, José nice. Arturo. Excellent, very nice. Ahora vamos a ver. Small. Les doy dando el adjetivo small. Vamos a ver. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Sería Central Park isn't as small as Parque Cuscatlán. Good. Ok. Estamos kind of practicing right now. Estamos tratando de, de practicar un poco de, la, de, de los ejercicios que hicimos el día de ayer. Ok, vamos a movernos. Let's move on to the next activity. And this activity, I know you are creative. I know you have a wonderful mind. You like to create. You like to have fun. What we're going to do right now, we oh. are going to add a conversation. Okay, 
we have a, um, a comic right here. Tenemos un cómico. And I want you to add the conversation based on the pictures. Vamos a ver. Basado en las fotos, quiero que se inventen una conversación que ellos están teniendo. En English. En inglés. Ok. Quiero escuchar esas ideas eh, wonderful that you have. Por ejemplo, ok. Listen to my example. Hey, Tiger, what are you reading? Oh, you don't believe I'm reading the book because I'm planning to cook somebody. Número tres. Hmm, somebody. Number four. Oh, no, the tiger is going to eat me. No, I didn't mean you. I meant a rat. <laughs> <laughs> See? Okay, that was my example. What about your example? Vamos a ver. Le voy a dejar un minuto, dos minutos para que piensen. I want you to think and create a conversation. Mm -hmm. Ok, vamos a ver. Ok, let me see. Welcome. Oh, ok. I have Fátima. Welcome, Fátima. Welcome, Elsie, Cristina. Welcome, Eric, Brenda, Elmer, and Claudia. Ok, welcome, everyone. Ok, vamos a ver. I know you have wonderful minds. So I want you to hear you create... Um, your creative mind, what you have inside, your imagination. Mm -hmm. Vamos a ver qué imaginación tienen. Teacher. Yes. Yes. Listo. I'm sorry, I'm back. <laughs> This crazy internet is taking me out. All right, so voy a ponerles el dibujito de nuevo, ¿ok? ¿Me pueden escuchar? Yes, teacher. Oh, ah, lo siento, el internet me está sacando, no sé por qué, pero aquí estoy de regreso, así que me disculpo, ¿ok? Uh -huh. All right. Um, ok, voy a poner, um, voy a compartirles nuevamente la pantalla para que vean eh, el dibujito between the tiger and the kid. Ok, ¿lo pueden ver ahora? Uh 